Hi, it's Adrian today. How are you doing? And so I'm back with some palettes that I didn't really get a chance to play with that much. And so I'm doing some second and third looks. And I hope that you really enjoy it. So it's sort of a new series. I'm starting um, at the new year. And I really, again, hope you enjoy them. So I started today with the LYS um, foundation. This one's in LN3. And then I went ahead and added the Pretty Fresh by ColourPop concealer. The LYS, you can actually get over at Sephora. And the Pretty Fresh by ColourPop, you can get at Ulta or on the ColourPop website. So that's what I did over there. And then as far as what I did for bronzer, I used the Soul uh, bronzer. This one is, uh, well, Soul's a sister company to ColourPop. And so with these, uh, you can get them on the same website as ColourPop. Uh, they're just in a different section. So again, I used the medium one for my bronzer today. To go ahead and use another LYS product, and I'm already starting. Yeah, this was uh, part of the three-pack uh, cream blush that they had over the holidays. This one is Empower. And so, yeah, the writing, uh, I'm already messing up the packaging. If I really like a product, I mess up the packaging. So, and the heater just kicked in. Um, I also use the Physician's Formula, the Mavi Mats as well. So this is the powder I put over the cream. Get an attempt to get uh, the blushes to go ahead and stay on my face until, you know, for at least a little while before they disappear. And I did go ahead and use um, the Flexitarian by ColourPop as well. I use this as my highlighter today. And let's see, what else? Um, so it's really LYS and ColourPop today. Uh, the Glowing Lips by ColourPop, and this one I used in lavender for the, yeah, for the lip color today. And then as far as the palette, I did go ahead and use the Avatar. And I haven't had a chance to go ahead and play with this palette. I remember seeing The Last Airbender, the movie. Um, I was never really into the franchise. I don't think we had it here. Um, so, or at least I wasn't aware of it. I've never really been into anime that much. And I know that they had a big franchise on anime. Um, but today I did go ahead and use uh, this one on my inner corner and under uh, the brow bone. Then this one in the outer corner, this one on the lid. And this one is actually very pretty. I don't know if you can see the purple shift in there, but here, let's just watch and see if we can. Actually, why don't I just go ahead and swatch the whole palette and I'll be right back. Hi, so um, yeah, I did go ahead and swatch the whole palette. Uh, this color right here has a really pretty shift. It goes from a light blue sort of to a purple. It's really pretty. And um, it's just gorgeous palette. The formula is really wonderful. And um, yeah, I think you can get a lot of good looks out of this one. So uh, this look that I got today. And what I did end up doing was I took a little bit of Flexitarian and I put it right on my lid over, um, yeah, so, um, and I think it turned out kind of fun. I, I just um, enjoy having a little bit of shimmer on my lid, so that's why I went ahead and did that. And um, again, this is available over at ColourPop um, on their website. This one is gorgeous, so if you want to pick up a fun little palette, um, again, this is, you know, available and just a really well-constructed palette and a really pretty palette. So uh, thank you, and I'll see you later, and I hope you have a good day. 